welcome to another Somerset Real Ale review. Um, Sunday night, bank holiday tomorrow, so it's beer time yet again. Do I have an evening excuse? Got the um, Bath Ales Golden Hair. Um, I think Bath Ales are near oh, Warmly, which is near Bristol. Um, <clears throat> yeah, really looking forward to this beer. I love uh, gold nails, fantastic. I've not had this before. I know very little about the um, uh, the Bath Ales, um, well, about the, their brewery. Um, their gem I've had before on cask, and I can remember quite liking that, so um, I, uh, yeah. Anyway, brown 500 ml bottle. It's got a nice little um, rabbit or hair, well, obviously a hair, golden hair, on the crown there. Fantastic, let's get it open. Don't know whether this is bottle condition, this one. Nothing really on the open in there. And that is coming out, yeah, lovely and golden. No, it's not, it's not bottle condition, do it be this one. Um, yeah, that's that. It's golden in colour. Nice bit of swirling carbonation in there. It's got a pure white, not even half a finger head, just a few bubbles on the top there. A little bit of conditioning, a little bit of lacing left on the side of the glass. Let's get the nose in. Whoa! That smells, um... Gorgeous. Um, I'm getting, uh... sort of a very light smell to that but there's also an undertone of something a bit sweeter it's, you can smell a bit of not wine but you can smell a bit of an alcoholiness of it it's only 4.4% ABV as well I think before yeah 4.4% ABV Getting sort of um, a very meadowy, fresh, sort of slightly zesty. It's almost an apple sort of an orchard, orchard smell. That smells very inviting. Um, I'm going to dig in. Cheers. Mm. Oh, oh my word! God, that is very unusual for a what? Well, that's very distinguished, massively distinguished, but good. You're getting a bit of carbonation at the start, with a very small bit of bitterness, and then you're led with this sort of, not not so much a sweet malty aftertaste, but a dry malty aftertaste, and a real woody character to it. Kind of that appley, woody, woody apple, like apple wood sort of. God, that's really distinguished and very refreshing as well. The more I smelt it as I've been drinking it, I think I notice this sort of floral aroma to it as well. That is, that is really distinguished. I can't compare this to anything else I've had, which is great. Um, yeah. Bath Ales, brewed for those who know. Golden hair is bursting with flavour and brewing with condition. It's a smooth yet dry, wonderfully fresh and delightfully zesty. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, and those who don't, 
Oh yeah. Um, we brew golden hair using floor malted marisol to barley and the aptly names Golding, Golding's hops. These binings, binding ingredients plus our brewer's skill and patience have helped to make golden hair a very rewarding light ale. Fine filtered for quality, it's best stored and served cool. Um, yeah, I mean, I love Golding's hops, you know, Marius also obviously quality barley, but it's um, smooth yet dry, yeah, it is, it is. Um, You get a sort of medium body mouthfeel on this as well. That's a wonderful beer. I love that aftertaste, it lingers in your mouth. It's definitely not bottle condition, but it says brewing with condition, but I mean, the trouble is it's very hard to tell because, like there's no head on it, you can't really tell the condition, but it, it, it does taste top notch this. is very zesty. Um, I think that bitterness at the start with the carbonation is kind of a bitter lemon. Um, that's very Moorish. I can quite happily session that. Um, I really like that. I'd definitely be getting some more uh, as, as along with the rest of their range. I'd like to try the rest of their range. Yeah, I think that's a good a good summer session of that. Nice one one for the barbecue. Uh, I'm really getting into, now the weather's warm, it's been lovely today, but nice and warm today. I'm really getting into my gold nails, IPAs, um, which I've got more of tonight. Um, well, it'll follow in, in suit, obviously. I only had to upload one video a night. Um, but that, I think for its, purely for its interesting, That's going to have to get an eight and a half out of ten because I really like it. I, it's just such a good bitter slash gold nail. Um, it's a little bit too bitter. I would say just be a, a plain gold nail. I, I would, I would. That's on the borderline between a bitter and I know it's great. It's a good, good summer on that. I love it. I love that beer. Fantastic. Um, thanks for watching. Love to see your comments in the comments box, and I hope you join me again soon on another review. Cheers.